Okay, is it recording? Yes, August 3rd. Um, UK Crush, Crush Nation, Crush It Fitness. We have many different team names right now. Um, we have yet to decide on what we're going to call ourselves because as we all know, guys. You want to put me in? I'd love to put you I in. Am, you want to be part am. of this? We'll sneak <laughs> over. Get over here. Um, as you know, um, the UK is just the start of this. Like, it's going across globally. This is just, we're just scratching the surface here with the UK thing. So we're trying to find a name that's universal and global and um, we'll get there. But uh, we're, how many days here? We're, we're within three months of launch guys. Um, we posted about it on our personal page. We've decided to, uh, we're going to come to London twice over the next three months. Um, we're going to come to the super Saturday, September 22nd, 23rd. Um, that Liz Dels is putting on, and then obviously we're gonna come for the launch on October 19th. Um, and we haven't yet, well, we're staying the first, October 19th, we're staying from the 17th till the Sunday, and then we still haven't just Sorry, I, We still haven't decided. I looked look like I wasn't wearing a shirt. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> you never know what's gonna happen on these Zoom Sorry, calls, guys. guys. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, um, we haven't decided for the first time how, how long to come uh, September 22nd, but we are going to bring the kids. So that kind of changes um, our plans and stuff, but we're super excited. Um, how many people on the call here? Okay, 27. So um, lots of stuff happening in our world. Um, I don't want to make any big announcements on this call, um, but all I'll say is that I'm hoping, and this is a good thing, you guys, um, I'm hoping by the time launch comes around, and I, I think all we already are, I think we're gonna have probably the biggest imprint um, in the UK as far as coaching goes, Crush Nation, which I think mm -hmm. is cool. Um, it helps all of you out significantly. We have um, some incredible leaders that are gonna join this team, and I'm telling you from experience, um, this business and your individual businesses, um, you can't do this alone. It requires a team, it requires a, a community. Mm -hmm. um, that's the part of the business that we love about it is that it's hard to be a lone wolf in this business. Yeah. It's really hard because um, you need the support and community and, and this, this team is just growing daily and um, we're super excited about that. And we're not gonna talk about genealogy and how the whole actual, your downlines work and all that. That is like, that's a conversation we'll have before October 19th, but it's not one initially when we have to cover some of the basics. What I want you guys to understand about network marketing, specifically Beachbody and the way their system is laid out is the is that we all benefit off each other. You want everyone to, to have an amazing organization and business because you can benefit off of each other. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm gonna say. We won't get into how that actually works, but. That's why network marketing actually works, is you want everyone to do, to do well. And that's why you have teams that grow pretty fast because they get that sense of community behind each other and support. And we even see it on UK Crush. I mean, we've only had this group now for maybe a month, maybe a little bit longer, and already I feel like you guys all know each other. And that's, for me, that is the signal and the mark of something pretty cool that's mm -hmm. happening. And we're getting messages. There's people on, on you guys are getting matches, UK crush people wondering what we're doing and how to become a part of this. Cause it really is going to be a big movement you guys. And that that's going to help all of us. So, um, I love that. Anything you want to say on that? You're good. I am good. Kim is good. So let's get into this guys. Um, cause I don't want to keep you too long tonight. I value your time. Um, let me share a screen here. And let's move this over to there. That's just the title. Um, I just put this up. This is some of our travels um, over the last kind of year or two. Um, that top one was the Italy trip. There's a few Italy shots in here. Uh, you see our kids in the top right. In case this is your first call for some of you, or some of you are just kind of meeting Kim and I for the first time. I'm not going to do a full introduction of who we are, but um, I just thought I'd throw this up. And that we had a house party in that bottom right. Uh, a lot of our local team came over. Um, and yeah, we're, we're kind of all about, all about the team and having fun. We work hard, play hard. So well, Michelle raised her hand and feel free you guys at any time, please. Um, I'm sharing screen, so I can't see everybody. I can only see a few people. So, and I can't see the chat when I'm sharing the screen. So 
if you have something to say, just take yourself off mute, speak up, interrupt me. That's cool. Cause if you have questions, I want to, uh, sorry. Yeah. Jenny, hi, it's only Michelle. Hello, my lovelies. Um, I just want, are we recording this call? Just, are we, is it being recorded? Oh yes. It is I didn't hear that bit. Sorry, I'm going now. Love you, love Thank you. you. <laughs> I'll let you know you what? With it. I, I, need that re- I need that reminder, so it's good, because sometimes I forget, so. Thank you. Okay, so. Okay, cool. I'm really, going to mute now. Sorry. That's okay. So, um, really quickly, just to share a little bit about, um, this journey of Kim and I's, and I don't want to spend too much time on this, but um, I, about eight or nine years ago, this is how I really got into Beachbody. Um, And what I love about, what I love about the transition into the the UK and then globally, what I love about is that you, you're all fans of Beachbody. Like you guys all have this passion for the company and the, the programs mm-hmm. and whatnot, and you're going to develop a passion for the products that are coming. But the actual programs, you are actually a step ahead of everybody. Really, not everybody who starts in North America because they do have some experience. But you guys have had this sort of buildup of getting the products and knowing the coaching opportunity is coming. And and for a lot of you getting started already, um, that's an important piece to this puzzle. Is mm-hmm. that you actually believe in the programs that we're doing. And I wanted to show you this because about eight or nine years ago, I was pretty miserable, (laughs) miserable human being. Um, Top left. Top left family picture. Yeah. Um, I had gained about 60 pounds um, through my old company, just stress stuff going on. And I just self-medicated with food. I've told the story a lot of times. Um, And I was watching an infomercial, um, Tony Horton P90X. Um, I ordered it immediately. I, uh, at that time, Kim was nagging me to work out. Mm -hmm. As most of you know, that usually doesn't work with spouses. Um, in fact, I probably wanted to eat more when she would do that. He did. But it came to a point in my life where, um, you know, I had an, I had a son, a, a brand new son. And, um, we actually, I don't know how it works in the UK, but we applied for, we applied for life insurance. Um, in case anything happened to us. And so what they do here in Canada, anyway, they bring a nurse into your home. They take all the blood tests. Like they're there for half an hour going through all the medications you're on and stuff like that. Um, I honestly never thought anything about it. I was about, I was probably 240 at that time. Um, sorry, I'm talking in pounds, not stones. Don't make me do the math. But um, I never thought twice about it. The nurse left. I got a call about two weeks later. Um, and she had told me I was denied life insurance. I didn't pass. And the, the insurance that I, was, that I was applying for was a 20-year term insurance. So I was paying the insurance company something like $200 a month, Canadian dollars a month, for 20 years. And they would cover me for, I can't remember what it was, maybe a million dollars. I can't remember. The, the insurance company, by denying me, they, they literally said, you don't, you don't qualify for this. What they were basically telling me is, it's about $50,000. The 200 bucks a month over 20 years is about $50,000 I would have given them over the 20 years. They literally were saying, keep your $50,000. You're not someone we want to bet on. Like you're someone who we think something is going to happen to you in those 20 years. Mm -hmm. So we keep your money. You know, we're, we're good here. That was kind of my wake up call at that point. And I ordered that P90X with Tony Horton. Um, I had a chance just at summit to have a conversation. We had a conversation with Tony at this party we're at with him not name dropping him, just sharing the experience with you. And we actually were both, I, we got a chance to thank him. And Tony and I both had tears in our eyes at the end of the conversation. It was like one of the coolest experiences of my life. Um, and so I, I'm telling you this story for a couple of reasons is that sometimes the craziest things bring Beachbody into your life. Um, and I think we all meet people for a reason. And I think you have to figure out the reason that you're on the zoom call right now. You have to figure out the reason where you want to go with your life. And there's a lot of people out there also, because I was one of them, there's a lot of people out there who are in a ton of pain, emotionally, mentally, physically. Um, and we've always felt our job as coaches um, is to reach those people. And whether you're a master trainer, doing personal training in a gym, um, coaching like us online from home, um, I think our mission really is just to reach as many people as we can because the way we live now is just better. Mm-hmm. We're happier. Our relationship's better. And that's kind of how we move forward with our coaching is we constantly, yeah, it's a business. 
yeah, we've both left our corporate jobs. We get to do this full time from home. Um, but it's never been about the money for us. Um, we don't talk about new houses and cars and stuff. We talk the fact that we actually get to do this for a living and we have the freedom to choose what we want every day. And if that's your goal, I think it's attainable. It's a lot of hard work. Um, but it's doable. Like this is, but, but here's the thing. And I, there's a quote I'm going to pull up in a bit here. You have to believe that's possible. You really do. And so I'm going to talk about some of the things on this call that I think are important. But um, if you want some really magnificent things to come from this opportunity, um, they're there for you. And they're probably the opportunity for all of you is a lot greater than it was for a lot of other people in, the, in North America, just because you're opening a brand new market and you know about this opportunity now. Like you could literally register on day one and start in a brand new market. And that don't, don't take that lightly. Like th this opportunity is huge. And I hope I always, I'm like, I wish people understand this is mm -hmm. not, not the serious enough seriousness of it because it is a fun business and we're helping people and we get to travel to these cool places, but it's legit a serious business opportunity that you can grab onto and it will literally change your life. And I'm not just saying that out of cliche. It will. You have to decide what you want though. Mm -hmm. And there, and you, you may not want that. Maybe you just want to, you know, have it as a little tool belt in your personal training and that's cool. And you want to help your clients that you see every day and maybe add a couple on client, online clients a month. That's cool. That's your thing. You have to decide that. What I'm telling you is that if you want to really reach big and play huge, it's a big opportunity. And I hope we can help you with that. I hope all your sponsor coaches can help you with that. The leaders on this team can help you with that. I just want you to know that it's, it's, it's definitely doable. I mean, this was, um, so the first time I went to summit, which is beach body summit, it was uh, Nashville, July, 2015. Um, I drove down alone. I didn't have any team members with there. Kim didn't even come down with me at that time. And if you can see the girl there on the left, um, I was sitting there we were, so they do training right at these beach body summit. They have um, some of the top coaches are speaking on stage and stuff. And, and we were sitting there. That was my first presentation I was going to, I, was, I think I'd been a coach for about three months. Um, and that's Lindsay. I kind of developed a friendship with her online because we were both kind of under the same team, but we were brand new coaches. I think we were diamond coaches at that time. And we were, um, we were watching our first presentation. I think it was with Scotty Hobbs, who's a big coach. And um, she actually like, she said to me at that time when we were watching that presentation, um, she said to me, she's like, I think one day you and I can actually speak on that stage at summit. Cause it's a big deal to get to speak on stage. Um, and then three weeks ago, the crazy part is, is you have to, you have to believe that things are possible, you guys, and you have to open up your mind to that. And I think what you'll find with Kim and I, um, on our team that we talk a lot about is mindset mm -hmm. and belief that things can happen and what you think about, you bring about. Um, and we're big believers in that. So I had the honor. That's a, I don't know if you know, Jessica Bowser Nelson, she's in the, uh, Insanity Max 30 cast. I had the honor to speak with her at the summit. So it was about two years to the day, guys. And again, another example that um, anyone can turn this into something pretty magnificent, but you have to believe it's possible mm -hmm. and you have to be willing to sacrifice some things. And you may even be, you may have to live a little bit in a life of unbalance for a while because that's sometimes what it takes to build something that's really successful. And sometimes people aren't necessarily able to do that. And I get that. But um, Man, for us to be able to work from home and kind of de design the life that we want, every small sacrifice that we've made in the two years. And when I say that, let's, I like to, I like to put in a dose of practice, yeah, a, a dose of practicality too, is like, you know, we're not, we're not going to war here. We're, we're posting on social media and working out every day and being a product of the product and helping people call online. Like I'm very much in tune with like, you know, we don't have the toughest jobs in the world. So it's not like the sacrifice I'm talking about isn't that grave. There's people who have to do much other, much more sacrificial things in the world, but we've put in a lot of time yeah. and we've been comfortable doing that because we've had a vision of what we wanted. We wanted to both come home and be closer to our kids and have a life of freedom. We get to wake up and do whatever we want every day. Yeah. That's what we wanted from this. And it's, a, it's attainable for you. So I just, Kind of want to throw this out there that not long ago, I was like you, getting into this business brand new, really not knowing what to do. I just jumped in. I didn't, you guys are going to have way more training and way more knowledge than I had on my day one when I signed up. You'll have, 
a hundred times more knowledge. I jumped in and just kind of figured stuff out. So you're way ahead of me on day one. So again, back to my point. Um, last slide I'll show you from this is that again, can you guys see that quote or are people in the way? Let's move it up here. It's my Jim Carrey quote. Um, again, we didn't, we didn't do this for stuff. Um, that's a picture of Kim and I walking the kids to school. We, we do it. We, we did this so we could have that freedom to walk them to school every day, pick them up, and really um, not have to put them into childcare mm -hmm. anymore. Because we, over the last eight years, I don't even want to add up the amount of money because it's not subsidized here. We have to pay like a lot of money for childcare. And we just got tired of paying for that too. So um, mm -hmm. everything we've done for this business is A, to help people, and B, to have some freedom in our life. So. One of our favorite this quotes. This is my favorite quote. Oh, it's Kim, yeah. Or ours. Yeah. yeah. Do you want to say anything? You haven't said a word. I, you were speaking so great. <laughs> you were so, is that shocking to most of you? Kim, I know. Kim hasn't said anything. <laughs> Do you want to say anything? James. I know. James, he's laughing. Um, no, I, I loved everything you said, and I it well, struck thanks. such a it struck such a deep chord because I have to be honest, guys, when Jamie when Jamie said, I, I think I want to do this business, Kim, we had, again, like he had mentioned, we had been customers and clients for nine years. Um, Jamie and his brother were entrepreneurs and this would, this was, you know, they had tried this belt thing right before the beach. Mm -hmm. So there was like all these little things that just kept on coming up. I knew Jamie had a bug. Like I knew he was looking for it. He was looking for the thing that we could grab a hold of and that would match and meet what our vision was, Life. what our purpose was, lifestyle. what we wanted our lifestyle to be, and what drove us. And I remember vividly when you started, I got really scared. I was working in the corporate world. I was, we were, I was doing, I mentioned all the stuff that we were doing before. And I also wasn't an entrepreneur. I was like in this box climbing this corporate ladder and I was chasing success, chasing that VP title, ch chasing all the things that I started to realize really weren't what was fulfilling me. It was just that next step because I was constantly searching for something else because I wasn't as happy as I thought I was in my corporate job. So when we started to make a real difference in this business and when we started, I started to step into my own power and this quote, I started to get unshakable. I started to realize that what we were doing wasn't this little thing. I, 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 I started to realize that we were actually making a real difference. I started to realize that we were actually starting to develop a real business that I didn't understand yet, mm -hmm. but I knew I could build my competence, which would build my confidence, which would make me and help me to be able to learn. And that's what happened. The more we learned, the more we grew, the more we loved this job, this profession, this team, this people, this industry. Um, and we realized how worthy we are of living a bigger life than we were. And that is what changed the game for me is when I realized that I could do this too. Yeah, and I, I think, I mean, I think for for a lot of you, even on this call, like, you're you're way ahead of the game than Kim and I, and I really mean that. Like, you, a lot of you are in touch with your clients already, and, and, and you have access to people who maybe, you know, and again, it's hard to speak generically, because we're all from different backgrounds, right? And you all do different types of stuff, and some people are training already, some people aren't. Um, what you have to figure out is where this fits into your life and into your career already. And, and whatever that, whatever that fits into, um, that's cool. And I think everyone on, everyone on this team is here to help you with that, to yeah. fit it in to whatever you want. Cause I know even like we have a lot of personal trainers on our team too. And, and some of their, some of them are like, no, I love, I love the live training. I want to do that as my main thing, but I do want to have an online accountability group for those people. And I do want to help a few people online and stuff. And that's cool. And that's what they love. Whereas we have other PTs who are like, I've been doing it for 10 years. Um, I want to make more money. I'm, I want to reduce the amount of time I'm in the gym and be able to be home yeah. more with my family. I still like live and I want to do that maybe mm -hmm. a couple hours a day, but I want to do more of this online and be home. So that's something you'll have to figure out about what your passions are and where you want to take this business. The cool part is the opportunity is there for you to design it any way you want. And I always just ask people, I still think the whole secret to this business and life and whatever you want, and we are all about being very much, we practice a lot of gratitude. Um, 
we practice a lot of positive affirmations and meditation we, and we attract no we we tend to because we practice yeah. this we we i feel like we attract a lot of positive people into our mm -hmm. life and creative people and, and creative inspired people, people. Mm -hmm. and i don't think things just happen for a reason either so yeah. um i think and I'm going to touch on personal development later, but in case I don't, I want to touch on this. And I know some of you, I, I know you will, because it's just human nature. I scoffed at it when someone told me this when I was coaching. They're like, you got to do personal development. I'm like, personal development? What? It's like, I, I took it as a sign of weakness for me. Um, what's personal development? But what I've realized is that, and I will make a really bold statement here for all of you. And some of you aren't going to believe me, and that's okay. I'll make a bold statement. Um... If you don't, and, and there's different types of personal development. It's not all like self-help. You need help and stuff. Some of it's confidence. Some of it is business personal development. Some of it is leadership personal development. There's all different types of books and podcasts you can read. My statement to you is, and you whether you want to believe me or not, that's fine. Um, I think it's so important to your journey, and we'll give you a list of, of topics or just message us if you're not sure what I'm talking about. If you don't do personal development, I, I title it PD. If you're not doing PD daily, um, you won't succeed as a coach. And I, I really mean that statement because, and I don't want to get too much into this. Yeah. You'll hear us talk about it all the time. You'll get sick of us talking about it. Um, it's because it kind of builds up an armor for you. It, it gives you the confidence to do this job so that when things, cause this, it's going to be like this, like anything really worth it in life, it's going to be like this. Um, and that confidence brings up your, it brings up your confidence. It brings up an armor because some people don't want to work out. They're going to mm -hmm. say no to you. They're like, no, I don't want to buy a challenge pack. They're going to go through all that stuff. And the other thing is it giving you confidence and you becoming more confident, it oozes through everything you do, all the conversations you have with people, how you carry yourself when you walk in a room, um, when you talk to someone about the coaching opportunity, having them join your team. When you talk to someone about coming in your accountability group and purchasing a program, that oozes through you. It mm -hmm. affects you how you deal with people. And that's why it's so important, you guys. Um, I won't lecture anymore on that. We, I'm just telling you from experience. Um, and again, it doesn't have to be like all self-help. I'm weak. Please make me stronger stuff. That's not what this is about. It's great business for some It's involvement. also about Good sharpening job. your leadership skills and your business skills and your organization, all that stuff is what I term personal development. I'll, st I'll get off my soapbox, but that's... I it's just, important. It's important. If you haven't figured that <laughs> Did out. Did you get that? <laughs> Do you want me to repeat that? <laughs> okay, let's get into some, what I would call training. Some of you know this stuff. It's good to um, repeat it. And you're going to know this like the back of your hand. Yeah. Um, what is a challenge pack? This is primarily... Did you have to... Say something? No, I can walk them through this. Oh, you go this for is it. My, you do it. This is my jam. I'm gonna get a drink of water. Um, one great. Second. Okay, so hey guys, so this is the this is the can you get me one? Yes. Thanks, Jay. Um, this is the challenge pack. So this is essentially what you are offering either clients or coaches when they are saying, I'm ready, I wanna sign up, and I wanna be a part of what you are doing. So a part of your accountability group, a part of your coaching tribe or team. So they are going to purchase the all access pass which typically um, what we like to call it is the Netflix of fitness. Uh, Jamie mentioned earlier that we literally have every single DVD that uh, Beachbody's ever made. And when we, when we would purchase the DVDs, we would also purchase the deluxe kit that came with it. So we'd get three additional DVDs that were mailed to us separately. And now what Beachbody has done is they have really tried to put the value out to as many people as possible. And they've rolled this all into what's called the all access pass. So what that means is that you literally have access to every single program that Beachbody's ever created prior, the new programs that they've released this year, and any future programs that they're going to create in the future. And you've got that via your laptop, your tablet, your phone, your computer, your smart TV, whatever device that you're able to stream this through. It also goes through a website and there's also an app, an application that you can get from the iPhone store or the iTunes store. 
iPhone store, iTunes store, um, or your app store. Uh, so it also it also comes with one month of Shakeology, the portion control containers, which is made from Autumn Calibri's, the 21 day fix portion control guide. Um, that's all rolled in as part of the challenge group. The other thing that's important to note is that every single program that is on the all access pass also has a corresponding nutrition plan with it. So not only are they just getting the portion can fix control meal guide when they purchase this challenge pack, they also have access to every single program uh, nutrition guide. And that's how as a client, we are able as coaches to help serve and support them based on their goals for which program they're going to start with. They've got access to your accountability group. They've got access to you as an online coach for a year. And that's what the challenge pack is. So it's uh, the program, the Shakeology, and all that comes with it. That's the challenge pack. And I know there's, and listen, I, I've heard through, just through having lots of Zoom calls with um, all of you and stuff like that, there's like, people are like, yeah, you know, people in the UK are pessimistic about Shakeology. And so they're pessimistic about it here too. Like it's not, a, it's not like everyone's like, give me Shakeology, you know, it's, it's not a free for all with people. Everyone is, is skeptical about this stuff too. Um, and we don't, we're not like. Until they try it. Uh, yeah, no, it's not, <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's not, yeah. it's not everything fits all. Like not everyone loves Shakeology. Yeah. Do we love it? We've been drinking it for three, four years. Yeah, we love it. I've noticed a change in how I feel. Um, but we're also not the type of coaches that like Shakeology cures everything. And it's, it's, you know, it's, it's a one size fits all type thing. We don't coach like that. What I will say about Shakeology and what I'm confident in, in it is that it's a couple things. It's, it's made very well. Like the quality of ingredients are phenomenal. Um, what I love about it is, and you have to thank you guys, all of us on this call for the most part probably are like, for the, we don't always eat perfectly because we all live a life of balance, but we kind of know how to eat properly. We know what healthy food is, clean, clean eating is. Um, we know how to exercise. We kind of know what that lifestyle is. You have to remember a lot of the people that you're going to be dealing with, a lot of your clients, they have no clue. They have no clue. And that's not being disrespectful. Mm -hmm. It's just facts. Um, I mean, there's, there's an obesity epidemic, not only in North America, probably in the U across the world, right? So this is what I love about Shakeology is, a, it's got all these superfoods in it. It's got stuff in it that Kim and I are never, or you, you're never going to go to the store, buy all these ingredients and put it in the mm -hmm. shake. It just, it's never going to happen. It, there are tons of stories on our own team, our clients. It cures a lot of um, emphysema. Um, it's really helped with IBS. IBS. Bowel system syndrome, Crohn's. Yeah, there's a lot of specific yeah. things it's really helped people with. Skin conditions, um, obviously energy levels, it, it curves cravings and all that stuff, but there are some specific things that are really helping people. What I love about it is for, for a person who doesn't know how to eat properly, they have the meal guide, they get the portion control containers, they have their 30 minute workout program, they've yep. got you as a coach to help them, their breakfast is covered. Yeah. They just drink Shakeology. They don't have to think about it. They don't have to worry yeah. about it. They're trying to get their kids out the door, maybe for school or on their way to their job. They take Shakeology. It's the healthiest thing they could ever imagine drinking in the morning. They put it in their shaker cup that they get with their challenge pack. They shake it with water, unsweetened almond milk, whatever their thing is, and they're out the door and they don't have to think about their breakfast. Yeah. For me, that's the value of Shakeology. That's the value of it. Yeah. And then you have these people who are like, they just, they never want to go off Shakeology because they feel so good on it. Um, yeah. I feel good on it. I'm not that far. I still drink it every day, but there are people who are like, oh my God, Kim loves it. It's like, because it just makes them feel better. Yeah. Um, and I can't tell you why all, what all 50 superfoods do in it. I don't know. But, but there's, a, there, again, we just posted, for example, in our accountability today, all about Shakeology and six things about the new ingredients. So there are resources yes. everywhere that can help you become that, experts that can help you come and be that educator of the why behind it you know for me i didn't know i'm just flagging it up there that <laughs> aptogens help deal with stress i have huge anxiety at times and i mm -hmm. get overwhelmed so for me anything that's going to help bring me calmness and that's going to support my system and support how i function and how i optimally age is important you know, and that yeah. was good for me. And it's kind of cool to be able to talk to other moms about it that have realized they've actually lessened their stress 
Mm -hmm. And they do attribute some of that yep. to healthy eating and working out and having a tribe and having people that are going to help, you know, help them when they need it. So that's important, the, right? The, this is a true story. And it, this, I'm not necessarily proud of this, but like, I'm not like, I wouldn't be in the top whatever percent of people who know what's in Shakeology and every, I can't explain all the ingredients and stuff like that. That being said, of the, I don't know, let's, you know, of the, of the three, four, 500 challenge packs, 600 challenge packs I've sold, I don't know, since I've been coaching, I've maybe a couple times had to tell people about the actual specific ingredients because what they believe is that what I'm telling them is that try this overall program, Shakeology is part of that. They buy into the fact that we're able to help change their life or put their life on a different path. The specific ingredients are important, mm -hmm. but that's not why they're joining you as a coach. No, and the other thing that's really important to note, guys, is, and, and we've had a lot of people say, you've changed our life. No, and, and I'm very clear to say, no, you've changed your life. You have been the one that has taken the control back in your life. This is a tool you can use to help them be educated in how they can fuel their body. Yeah. The accountability group is a resource for them to lean into so that they can become very strong. The workout programs don't change their lives. They change their lives by pressing play every day and sweating every day. You help to change their life by giving them the tool belts they need the tools in their tool belts that they need to be the person that they want to be. And that's a really important thing to note mm -hmm. is that we aren't the quick fix. You are going to be that vehicle. You are going to be that inspiration. You're going to be that cheerleader. You're going to be that shoulder sometimes. But at the end of the day, you are giving them a very powerful gift in their hand for them to be their change agent. Mm -hmm. And that's really important to understand and very clear as a coach yeah. that I want to make sure to hit home, you know, because that's important to put the power back on them. You mm -hmm. know, I just wanted to make that note. No, it's good. I just, cause I know a lot of people talk about Shakeology and stuff. So, and, and it, it's a, it's a big part of the business too. So, um, and Shakeology is something that actually they're taking control of their lives. Our kids have it and it's, it's fantastic. The one thing I wanted to just note, so um, there was a question there about the accountability group. The accountability groups are run online. There's two ways I, that you can do I that. I think maybe they, that's the same, it's the same thing as a challenge group. The challenge group is the accountability group. It's run online, Facebook. There's also what's called the challenge tracker app um, that Beachbody has that we're gonna be, we're gonna be testing as well. Yeah. So everyone's gonna be able to experience what it looks like to have either the app or the challenge group to make sure that you have options on how you serve your clients and how you serve your potential coaches as well. Yep. Okay. So just so you can see, this is, um, so we talk about success club. So, um, success club is basically, it's, it's like a monthly measuring tool of how a coach is sort of doing in their immediate business. It's how many clients or coaches are they adding onto their team? Um, so basically, you see on the right, we do a success club leaderboard every at the end of every month because the number resets. So whatever your success club number is, it goes down to zero every month, and then you 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 build up your success club points. And I went over the challenge pack first, and Kim did because every time that you sell a challenge pack to a client or coach, or we like to say it, every mm -hmm. time you help somebody with a challenge pack, you get two success club points. Okay, so. SC5, Success Club 5, SC10, Success Club 10, those are the two benchmarks sort of that Beachbody has made for a coach to hit. So if a challenge pack is worth two points to get to Success Club 5, you basically need to sell three challenge packs and you've hit your benchmark. And remember, you can, you can sell a challenge pack to a client or a coach. It's the same price. It's the same thing. They're just signing up as either a client or a coach. Okay? And then obviously to hit Success Club 10, to hit success club 10, you have to sell five challenge packs or help five people. And the, the only difference between really a client and a coach, it's the same price. It's just obviously um, when someone signs up as a coach and buys a challenge pack, their coach fee gets waived. So normally it's, I think it's like 60 Canadian dollars. I think that's 20 or 30 pounds to you pay as a coach fee when you sign up. But if you purchase it with a challenge pack, it's just waived. So a client or coach pays the same price to join a lot of times. Um, if we think people are even going to stay on Shakeology for a long time, they'll sign up as a coach right away, even if they're not sure if they want to run the business, 
because also as a coach, you get a 25% ongoing discount. If they're going to stay on the Shakeology or purchase anything else, they would like the discount. Mm -hmm. And then I just, on the right there, we do a leaderboard for all of our coaches to see, uh, to see where they're at. They like to see how they're measuring up against everybody else and stuff yeah. like that. Um, and that leaderboard is going to grow dramatically by the, uh, the last quarter of this year. So um, does that make sense? Any questions on that, you guys? Challenge pack's worth two points. And again, it's, it's not about points. It's about people. Like those numbers really represent people we've helped. But it is a business and businesses are run sometimes on numbers and you have to measure numbers to determine how you're doing. Um, and Beachbody has set an SC5 and SC10 goal because if you're hitting those, it means you're moving your business forward. It means you're adding coaches, you're adding clients. And some of those clients, you're gonna put in your accountability group, they're gonna fall in love with the products, they in turn are gonna to wanna to turn into a coach to help other people. Any questions, guys? There's a couple here. So Joe, um, so yes, uh, they do need to still pay the monthly coach fee. I always, I always liken it to a, a Sam's Club or a Costco. I need to learn what's in London. Um, that's those the stores with a membership. So anything, think of it as the membership for the discount. Um, yes, so you would still be able to, you would still be paying that coach fee, whether you're a hobby coach or an active coach. It's part of the discount component yeah. um, as well. And I'm guessing... I'm, and we're not sure how much it's going to be in the United Kingdom. There has not been any word on that. I'm, I'm guessing the coach fee is probably going to be like 12 or 13 pounds, but I even hate guessing that. Yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't even guess. I'm just doing the math in my be. head what I think it'll be. Um, if I had to guess on the challenge pack, again, oh, okay. again, I'm not sure. Um, I'm going to guess the challenge pack is probably going to be 90 pounds to, I don't know, 120. It depends what they, what they put it at. But again, you got to think... Yeah. For let's say for a hundred pounds, let's say you guys know what it costs to personally train people. You know what it costs for gym membership yep. and stuff. They literally, Classes. they literally for a month, they get like five thousand dollars worth of programming on Beachbody on demand yeah. and any type of workout you want. And oh. for the entire year. And for the year. Oh, so that could be a one-time fee if they choose to not stay on the. That, right. Yeah. That 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 alone is probably worth a hundred pounds for people, and then you yeah. throw in the fact that you get you know remember you get a month of Shakeology to try, you get the containers, you get all the meal guides, and don't, this is the one thing you guys, they get you as a coach. Yeah. They get you as a coach, and you're basically a coach for free, and they get your accountability group and all the work that you put in that, that's what they get in that cost too. So for 100 pounds to get all that, I don't know. I, for me, I think it's a ridiculous deal for people to get that and have that accountability. And, and I think it's really important. Um, I think it's really, really important to understand the value behind what you do yes. as well. Um, and we'll talk a lot about this, but when I'm speaking to potential clients or potential coaches, the, the way you're able to present with your passion and your purpose and the effort that you're going to put into and to give to them, to help them understand that. Yeah. Um, they don't question generally the cost because the value is so fantastic in comparison to going to a gym, like you said, or it, it's just, it's such a great value. So the more you learn, the more familiar you become with it, the more you understand about the products, yeah. the more that I think it will be really a non-negotiable and it's a non-brainer, a non-brainer, a no-brainer. <laughs> there's, a, there's a couple questions there. Um, no, you won't get the discount until you're actually a coach. Um, until you sign up October yeah. 19th. Um, I, I, I know there's people in UK getting Shakeology. Someone there has been selling it. Um, I know we've been, we've been told we're not allowed to actually ship anything to anyone in the UK until it launches. They haven't said we can't bring it to the Super That's Saturday true. in September. That's true, but they've told us we can't, <laughs> we can't ship out any samples or anything yeah. like that. So um, when people want to try Shakeology, do they get the 3D money back? Oh, yeah, absolutely. They could, Petra, they can literally... Um, this is the thing about Shakeology too, and I, I say this every time I'm about to help someone with a challenge pack. Yeah. You you could literally finish the bag of Shakeology. You could you could order the challenge pack, get get the Shakeology, try it out for 29 days, literally finish, almost finish the entire bag of Shakeology. You could then crinkle it up into a envelope and ship it back to Shake back to Beachbody. They will refund your whole money. Like there's not there, there's nothing, and this is the thing about a challenge pack, guys. No one has anything to lose here. The only reason people don't purchase a challenge pack 
and sign up for this deal and getting their, your accountability groups because the value is so good. The reason they they don't do it is because they're afraid. Like they're, they're afraid of failing again. They're afraid of getting in shape. Like mm -hmm. you guys know you deal with, with your clients already. People are just scared. They, they don't want to fail again because at the end of the day, they can order the challenge pack. They can come in your group for three weeks and they can send everything back if they want. It's literally yeah. risk-free. Which has only happened twice to me in two and a half years, yes. to be honest, if I can say that, which yeah. is fantastic. And you have to remember that, you know, we really try to, to have the great customer service, but also great content in our accountability group. So part of them joining on with you is also the service that you offer. And many of you run incredible challenge groups, I can already imagine. Um, so you need to, you need to just, be aware of that. You're already doing a lot of this great stuff. Now you're just adding another layer to it, which is exciting. It's not, it's not a huge difference to what you're doing. Now mm -hmm. you just have even more tools to be able to serve your clients, more tools to serve, serve your coaches at your fingertips. Like that's the exciting part about this. It's just adding to what you're already, a lot of you are already doing. Um, and yes, just Caroline, it does the, um, it does, it covers the, it covers the um, Beach Body On Demand for the entire year. It's a one-time cost for the entire year for your Beach Body On Demand. And I, th I think to uh, at the end of the year, I believe if I'm doing my math, it's probably going to be about forty or fifty pounds again to sign up for another year yeah. for the Beach Body On Demand. So, yeah. Which again is for a year of all that is yeah. is, is pretty good. Um, and so, oh, what was I going to say? Oh, that's the other thing. Um, I'm going to give some resources over the next week. Um, and talk about, um, I know a lot of you are already running challenge groups and that's something you could start up even now with Beach Bunny On Demand, um, but that's something I'll give some resources on that. And um, for us with any, any accountability group, um, and we also run a lot of five day free groups um, mm -hmm. for clients to come and kind of come in for five days and then at the end of the five days, it's kind of like then they're coming to watch what we're doing on social media yeah. and we provide value to them in the yeah. free groups, right? Yeah. But I was going to say is that we have, we have all of the posts and scripts for accountability groups. We have a bunch of five day free groups that we've set up. So don't feel like if you're like, I don't know how to run an accountability group or I don't know how to run a clean eating five day free group. We have all that stuff. Yeah. And a lot of people on this call have their own stuff too. Yeah. So we it's all about, it's all about sharing and we've got all that stuff for people. I mean, a big part of this business is duplicity yeah. and being able to pass down all the resources so you don't have to reinvent everything. Right. Okay. You have to go. Yeah, that's fine. I'm sorry. Go. You. I have to go get our cheerleader. Our daughter. <laughs> <laughs> so you're going to take I'm gonna finish Are you going to take, will you pick up Colby? Uh, yes. Okay. Okay, great. Sorry, sorry for parenting. parenting. Mid-call okay. parenting. <laughs> Um, okay, so let's quickly, any questions you guys you want to take yourselves off mute? Bye everybody. Excited for our next call. See you later. Bye Kim. Hi. I'm the cheerleading mom. What's the time here? <laughs> it's, uh, you see, do you see how I know I'm getting old? I have to look back from my watch. That is depressing. Um, it is quarter to five here. 4.45. Go see your watch. What's that? I said, as long as you can still see your watch, you're good. Oh, it, I don't know. It's <laughs> getting easy. All right. Uh, oh, a few questions here. Let me see here, guys. Yeah, thanks, Drew. Where was the kiss? It wasn't there. Um, is there any help training on which program to recommend clients based on their fitness level? Um, we usually, there. I believe they have some guides on the Beachbody uh, website. Um, we have never made up something because, man, I feel like that's so specific for some people based on age, level, injuries, all that stuff. Um, but uh, let me look at some resources in the back office on that. You guys wouldn't be able to access them because you don't have access to that, but I'll have a look. Just let me make a note of that and see what they've got back there. I mean, I'll be honest with you, for the longest time, um, I mean, when we started coaching, there were so many people came to us who were like, just hadn't been exercising or eating properly for years. So a lot of times we would just put them on the 21 day fix basic plan because at that time, that was the only one that came with 
the containers and a meal guide for them. And they had a modifier in there and that seemed to be the easiest one that they could do. It's like, I wasn't going to put people on Insanity Max 30 right away, you know, and turn them right off, which happens. You're like, yeah, let's do Insanity right away. Um, so we just use 21 day fix, but then now we kind of, we tailor it. And if you're, if you're ever stuck, just reach out to, to one of your leaders or whatever, or someone in your group and ask them what you think that happens in our group all the time. They're like, Hey, I've got a client with this, this, and this, what do you think is the best program for them? And everyone kind of helps you out. Um, but yeah, Claire, 21 day fix is a good one to start out. Um, okay. So there's a few questions. I'm just going to, I don't want to, uh, I don't want to keep you guys past the, uh, the hour. So let's just jump into this and let me do, uh, let me give you a disclaimer here on, on, and when I talk about genealogy, I'm talking about the organization from where you start and your legs and stuff like that. Um, and I don't want to dive into that today. That is like fourth generation training that we will get to. There are a lot of coaches who coach for six months and they still need help with this part of the business. So don't feel like you need to know this or understand it right away. Um, that's what I'm here for. That's what, I mean, and I've told a lot of people this already. I have coaches who've been coaching for two years. They're like three-star diamond coaches. They're really successful. They still message me today and I'm like, I have a coach. She's a business builder. I think she's going to be awesome. Where do you think she should go in my legs and in my genealogy? And I still go in and look and help them place them. And so don't feel like you need to understand all this. Even when you launch, that's what, that's what the group's here for. That's what the support here is here for. So the legs and the genealogy, you're going to need help with that, and that's okay. What I want to talk to you about is really basically is that every coach has a left leg and a right leg. You have a left leg and a right leg that goes all the way down. Again, I don't want to jump into this too deep. Just know this. One of your legs, at the start especially, one of your legs, um, and it can be either one depending on where you're put, and again, I don't want to get into that, one of your legs you actually share with a lot of other coaches. And I don't know if that means much to you, but in long and short of it is that you have to add coaches, your own personally sponsored coaches onto both legs, but one of your legs, other coaches are going to add people onto that leg too. And it just keeps going. Like when I signed up as a coach about four or five day, days in from when I signed up, I went into my back office the genealogy doesn't look like this. It's a little more professional. But I went in and I looked and I had like four coaches down my right leg and I had no idea who they were. I had no idea who they were. Just know the way this system works and it benefits everyone is that you're going to have coached play, coaches placed on one of your legs in your downline as we call it. They're going to be added from coaches above you because you all share that leg. That's a good thing. It means those coaches, some of them that get added on your one leg, even the people you don't know who they are and you may have never heard of them, you can benefit from them and you can actually earn income from them. So I'm going to stop there. If you want to know more about that, there's stuff on YouTube. We'll do more training as we get closer to the launch. Like I might even have an hour long training session on a Tuesday night that's optional for all of you and I'll really dive into genealogy and I'll talk specifically about that and you can hop on and we'll do that because it requires like a solid hour to go through. So I don't want to do it here. But as far as, em so Emerald Coach is like the first rank to get to as a coach, an Emerald. And because you have a left leg and everyone has a right leg. And this is something, honestly, I think because you have like two months until launch or two and a half months, or however many weeks it is now, because you have this much time, I don't think there's any reason anyone on this call can't open up on day one as at least an Emerald coach. You just have to add two coaches into your organization. One goes on the left, one goes on the right. And don't worry about how you place them. We'll help you with that on that day of where they go. But that's all you need is two coaches. And consider this, you guys. Most people will sign up significant other spouse, family member, not because they want to coach, um, not because they want to run the business actively. They strictly do it for income purposes. And again, I won't go into it, but think of it almost like if you sign up your spouse, you have the option to um, all the volume that's created from the organization that you build. It can flow up through your spouse and through you as well. And I know that may not make sense right now, 
But that's the reason if you ask the top 100 coaches in Beachbody, what's the first thing or what's one of the first things they'd probably do, they'd be like, oh, you'd probably sign up your spouse as one of your coaches to get to Emerald right away. And that's just what most people do. Um, or you could sign up, you know, a family member to do it or something like that. Sometimes um, spouses aren't always as supportive because maybe they don't understand the concept or the financial implications that could come from this opportunity. That's kind of normal. That's not out of the realm that sometimes they don't really understand it. That's cool. It's all about explaining it. And I even do team calls where I'll do spousal team calls where we get all the couples on and I kind of go through what the benefits of, of the business and stuff like that. Cause I find sometimes being a dude um, and being like a guy's guy who plays sports and drinks beers, sometimes I can kind of get through them and be like, no, this actually has a really huge potential. Let me explain to you how it works. So sometimes that works as well. So um, basically I, like I said before guys, um, I think you all can open as an Emerald coach on day one. Um, and remember you can still sign up a client as a coach who may not want to, they may not want to do the whole business, but you can still sign them up. Like a lot of friends and family, my first coaches were people who I was like, hey, sign up with the challenge pack, come in my accountability group. We're going to lose weight. I'm going to help you do it. But sign up as a coach right away. And then you get a discount on Shakeology going forward. And they were like, yeah, sure, sounds good. And they signed up as a coach. It's the same price, right? And then if they stay on the Shakeology, they save the money every month. So does that make sense? You have to have one personally sponsored coach on your left, one coach on your right. That is an Emerald coach. I'm just going to go through the chat here. Any questions, you guys, on that? And again, if, if you need help with this, YouTube is a great resource. You can punch in Beachbody, how to become an Emerald coach, and they'll let you know. Um, a lot of people sign up their parents as a coach the first time because they want to help you with their business. And it's also like my mom's 75. She does the workouts every day. She loves Shakeology. My dad does it too. Um, so it's good for everyone. So I'm just going through the chat here. Any questions, guys, before I keep rambling? Can you leave your coach number to another family member, kids? Um, Drew, do, you, do I mean like you have to be 18 in North America to sign up as a coach? I'm assuming it'll be the same in the UK. I don't know if that was your question. If you can't get two legs, is that it? Emerald coach is, a, no, everyone, you, you automatically have two legs. Like everyone gets two legs. It's your responsibility to keep building both legs. Um, so I think your question, Drew, is that there's two parts of the business. One part is like the retail side of the business where you can sell challenge packs and you make a commission. You make 25% off challenge packs. This part of the business, like being, becoming an emerald and a diamond, that's building your organization and adding coaches onto your legs that want to work the business and stuff. I hope I answered your question. Can you and your spouse have a joint account? Um, I'm not sure what that means, Amy. Um, I think it has to be under one person, each account. Um, but you get the discount, so if you just want to order for two people, you just keep ordering and you get the discount on any product. Wiz, yes, 2PS. PS stands for personally sponsored. Because remember, a personally sponsored coach is someone you've signed up, whereas you're actually going to have coaches added in your organization from other people. Those aren't personally sponsored. Again, I don't want to confuse you guys here. Here's a good question, and maybe I'll get your guys' advice on this because I don't know the answer to this. So signing up someone, and feel free to unmute yourselves, you guys. Um, Signing up someone with Beach Bunny on Demand now or waiting until launch and selling them a challenge pack? I'd love to hear your opinion on that. I'm um, getting my people to do the trial. So they've done the 14 day free trial with me. Perfect. Um, my coaches have then signed up to Beach Bunny on Demand. So they've stayed on the program. But my actual customers um, in my community, people that are going to be retail customers of mine, I haven't got them to go on to Beachbody On Demand yet. Okay. I'm saving that for when I'm officially a coach. Same as me, Liz. That's exactly what I'm doing. Okay, I like it. Yeah, because I think for me, if I have, um, you know, you have your immediate friends and family and your close community that I know will, will start doing Beachbody On Demand challenge groups with me. 
Um, and to be honest, I know that for that first year, then you don't get that commission. So it's just a big group of people that I would lose out on if I did it now. And that's why I'm running from like your advice, Jamie, um, running my challenge groups now, uh, but not beach body challenge groups. I'm just giving people fitness and health nutritional challenge groups to keep them motivated and get them ready and building up their fitness a little bit. So when coaching starts, they're ready for a longer program a day. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. They're just changing healthy habits. I'm kind of doing now, really. And also, I think it gets them into the habit of um, of looking at things online and doing, you know, being a little bit accountable themselves. Yes. And working out online, which I think a lot of people are not used to doing, especially well, especially around their media, not at all. Yeah. Mine are definitely. Uh, mine is definitely a group of habit changing, like getting people prepared for healthy habits, ready for the launch. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. I like that. Does that makes sense to everybody. Um, and because really you, you want to like on that day one, I mean, I think for all of us on this call, um, you're here for a reason. So I think minimal day one, I think becoming an Emerald coach is very do, it should be doable. That should be a goal for all of you on day one, like minimal. Um, and I think that first month while well, October will be a short month, but even then, I mean, if you do the work now, Success Club 5 or 10 should be achievable for everybody. It really should. If you start, you know, reaching out to people and sort of, um, you know, the way I did it, honestly, my, the, when, I first, when I first started, and I'll walk you through how to launch your business. We have all the training for that. But the other thing I did in my first week or two is I just, I went to my friends and family. I said, listen, um, and I was really honest with them. I, I'm, I said, I'm starting this business. Um, it's health and fitness. It's really cool. You do the workouts online. Um, I'm starting my accountability group in like four weeks. Um, and I did this with about 20 or 30 of my close friends and family. I just said, listen, I said, I said, I'd love your support. Um, you get to work out and actually get healthy. It's not like they're just doing your favor. Like they're actually, they're coming in and getting, they're getting product and stuff to improve their life. And I said, I'd love your support on this. Um, come on in, buy a challenge pack. Um, you know, I would love you to come in. And this is the other, this is the other key that worked too. As I said, I'd love for you to come in my accountability group and I'd love your advice and feedback on how it's going. I said, so come in, buy a challenge pack, support me, and then come in the group and I'd love your feedback on how the accountability group is. Like, how do you think it's going? Do the month long group with me. And then I want to know from you, be, be honest with me how it went. Then they feel like they're a part of what you're doing because you've asked them for feedback. And I would encourage you all to do that. Like, just reach out to your close friends and family and just be like, hey, I'm, I'm starting this business. Come support me. You know, it depends on your relationship with them because some people are weird about that. But um, that's what I did. And honestly, I think I got about 10 or 15 people from my first group. Most of them bought challenge packs. I think I let a couple people in with just Beachbody, with just the DVDs. Um, and some of those first people in that first group, like my, my brother – was one of those people who was like, nope, not I just, I was like, come on, Mike, and Mike's my brother, I'm like, just come in here and buy a challenge pack from me, support me, and he finally did, and Mike is one of, one of, you know, my best coaches, he's an elite coach, five-star elite coach, and just from coming in the office, you never know who's going to turn into a coach and, and, and want to build the business too, so, I'm just reading your, your thing here, Claire. Yeah, there, I mean, there's going to be, be people who have pieces and portions of the program and stuff, right? Um, we always market it as just like the challenge pack is the complete thing for people. Um, and also, remember, as a coach, the results that people get in your groups, the, the results of your clients that purchase challenge packs and come out of your group, that, that's your business. Like, you need to get results in your business. And if they leave off a part, if they don't do the portion control containers and do their own meal plan, if they do the containers and do Shakeology but do some other workout program, that, you know, if they do everything but don't do Shakeology, that affects your business. That affects the results that you're going to get in your business because if those people feel great and after two or three weeks they're like, holy crap, I feel amazing. I haven't felt this great in a long time. Guess what happens? They're going to stay on Shakeology. They're going to tell all their friends and family about how great they feel and about how awesome your group is. And those are the people who are going to want to join your team as a coach eventually. So it's important that they get all parts of the challenge pack. Let's it through here. 
we join on day 21 through you, how do we get two coaches to join if they are not there? You do it all online, Marcus. You register as a coach, you get the email from Beachbody, you fill it out right away, you're now a coach. I'm gonna teach you beforehand how to use the mobile app on the phone. You literally have your two coaches with their email address and what flavor they want. You pick up your phone, you log into the coach mobile, you enter their order, you hit submit, they finish it five minutes later, the other person finishes it five minutes later, you've got your two coaches in your system. It's so easy from your phone, guys. And I'll show, I think some of you have done the checklist that shows you how. Does that make sense, Marcus? It'll, it happens really fast. You can sign up coaches and clients in like two minutes. As long as they know the email is coming through, they get the email and they complete the order through the email. Hope that makes sense. Okay, we're actually out of time, but I think I have one more slide here. Okay, so again, this is what I would call a diamond roadmap. It looks a little bit different from the Emerald. Remember, Emerald is one coach on your left, one PS coach on your left, one PS coach on your right. Um, diamond rank, everyone talks about, you know, ooh, this diamond rank in Beachbody. And it is important because it means, it means you're building an organization. It means you're adding coaches onto your team. And that is part of this business. And for me, I mean, I, I still love helping people get results. Kim primarily runs our accountability groups now. I did the first year and then we kind of transitioned and figure out what we did best and stuff. But um, that's kind of her jam, you know, and I still, I still love it. I still work with a lot of guys and some women and get them results and stuff. But I love helping people build businesses. Like I love it when I get a message from, you know, just for example, like last, maybe it was last month, um, you know, I had a coach who, who she's finally able to leave her office job that she absolutely hates. And she's finally able to come home with the income she's making from Beachbody. And she's allowed to leave her office job and she can now be home and is building her business. That's the, I love that stuff. Like for me, that's why I do this. That's why I love waking up in the morning, you know, and that's the part of business that I love. I'm not saying I don't like people getting results, but the business mentorship side for me is what I love. Um, and so, I don't know why there's red lines suddenly across there, but for me, um, becoming a diamond coach is part of that process of you advancing your business and your organization. So first rank is Emerald, one coach on left, one coach on right. We're all gonna get there day one, right? Right, okay. Diamond coach, and here's the thing. Some people on this call, on day one or two, are gonna turn diamond. You're gonna turn diamond rank. I know you are, because you've already got a lot of people in your system. Um, how do you turn diamond? It's four coaches on your left leg and four coaches on your right. And I know your question is, well, how do you know what leg they go on? You can determine what leg they go on and also Beachbody goes them. So if you signed up three coaches on day one, Beachbody actually rotates them automatically to your left, your right, your left, your right. And again, we'll talk about why left and right is important and who to go where later. But for now, just so you know, a diamond coach is four coaches on your left and four coaches on your right. So basically eight coaches that you sign up on day one, two, your first week, month, whatever your goal is, that's how you turn diamond. It's a big step in the business. It's huge. Like we make a big deal out of it. We do big recognition posts for our coaches. Um, there's one catch to being a diamond coach though. One of the four coaches on your left and one of the four coaches on your right has to be an Emerald coach. So this graphic I just showed you, if I can go back, no, it's not letting me go back. So remember, maybe the first coach there, the PS coach, I don't know if you can see my cursor, but any of the four coaches on your left leg, they also have to add a coach onto their left leg and a coach onto their right leg. They have to turn emerald as well as another coach on your right leg has to turn emerald and then you turn diamond. Now I can see some of your faces and some of you are like, what just happened? So. Here, let me get the chat up. Does that make sense, you guys? Speak up if it doesn't. Honestly, it's not a, if you don't understand this, it is not, don't feel bad. It's, this is the hard part to understand. Kind of all good? Even though I know you don't understand the whole geology, that kind of makes sense, right? Four on your left, four on your right. So, so let's say you, let's say you have this goal of you have a lot of people you're like yeah i can get you know five of my friends to probably sign up they'll try the coaching maybe my mom spouse i've got some other people that are interested in the business 
I think I can turn diamond in the first week. That's your goal. Or the first month even. That's your goal. How it would happen is you sign up as a coach. You get your mobile phone out and you start signing them up as a coach as you go. We place them where they're supposed to go on your tree. Left leg, right leg, left leg, right leg. And then you show your coaches you sign up. This is how you go Emerald. And they sign up two coaches through their mobile app. So far, so good. It makes sense, you guys. And that's basically, the, those are kind of the first two ranks I would focus on if I was you. Um, and what happens is, I mentioned the retail side of the business. I call it retail because that's just the best way to describe it. When you sign up clients and help clients and put them in your accountability group and you sell them a challenge pack, you make a commission on that. That's 25%. That's easy to understand. 25%. You don't have to worry about shipping it out. You don't have to worry about product. You don't have to buy the product and resell it. Beachbody handles shipping. Uh, they build a custom. You don't have to worry about everything. It's all tracked in your back office. You can go and look at all your clients. And it's all taken care of. It's a cool part of the business. Um, but this second part of the business where you build your own team and organization and you can earn income off how they do, the only way you can do that is by first getting to Emerald rank and then building the diamond rank. And then when those coaches start building the organization, you can earn income off of them as well. And it just goes on and on and on. And some people are like, like I've built a really large organization, Kim and I have. And people are like, man, you must be, you must be really helping your upline coach or whatever. Like the person that Miguel who signed me up, honestly, I'm friends with Miguel. He helps me the odd time and stuff. I don't think about what I'm doing for him. I don't think about my upline coach. I think about my business, like I'm the CEO of my business, and my job is to help grow my team and to help my coaches succeed. My job is to help my coaches build the biggest organization as, as they want, and if that is their goal, and to allow them to help as many people as possible. That's my job, is to help my coaches be successful and reach their goals, whatever they are. And again, guys, all this stuff, and I urge you, I'm going to take it off screen share here. I know it's a lot of information. I urge all of you, um, one of the greatest skills you can have in this business is being resourceful, being a researcher, be a sponge. Like, if you really want this business, learn about it. Find other ways to do things. I'm going to overload you with training. Don't worry. Like, once I put all of you into our training program, you're going to be like, what? Like, it's a lot of info. So don't worry about that. But part of you learning this business and understanding it is like taking the ownership to make sure that you understand how to do it, you know, and you, you take the steps to do that. And if you can do that, um, man, it's a really cool business. Like it, I've, I've done past business before. Nothing compares to this. The fact that you can, like my brother and I opened, opened up our first retail store in 2001. It was a pet store. It was like a dog lifestyle store. We sold like holistic dog food and fancy bowls. Like we sold clothing for dogs, literally. It cost us, think about this. It cost us $200,000, it's Canadian. So about 100,000 pounds to open a retail store. We had to fill it with product. We had to pay employees. We had to pay like, I remember our rent was like $7,000 a month in rent we had to pay to our landlord to keep our business open. We had employees. We had to pay, um, you know, medical insurance for employees. All that stuff we had to do to run a business in the hopes that we would make money after maybe a couple years. You get to start a business for 100 pounds. Like 100 pounds you get to start a business. And it's a business that you're – probably already passionate about the products and the company and the main the main thing about this business the number one priority that you have to worry about is keeping yourself healthy and being a product of the product and posting a little bit on social media if you want that part of the business posting a little bit on social media and sharing your journey about what you're doing I mean I don't know any other business that your main priority is is taking care of yourself getting healthier working out every day um, helping other people do the same thing, getting to like build an online business, which I don't care who you talk to. I will talk about this all day long, being a business person. Everybody in any industry that you're doing right now needs an online component to your business. You have to have it. You have to. It's just whether you like it or not, that's the way the world's going. Say, 
Kim and I are doing a presentation at the uh, the World Fitness Expo in Toronto here, and we're actually speaking to like a thousand personal trainers, and I'm kind of scared going in because I don't know how it is there, but they're actually they don't really like the online portion of stuff because they feel like you need to be in the gym with people. And I get that. I think in a perfect world, do I think everyone should have a personal trainer? Of course. Of course. We should all have a personal trainer that we get to go to the gym with and they show us what we're doing and how to do it. And of course, that, but that's just not reality, right? It's just not reality for people, unfortunately. Um, so it's like having this online component to, to the business and the fitness industry isn't excluded from this. It's the way it's going. Like, one of the biggest gym chains in Canada, the biggest gym chains in Canada, they are worried right now about at-home workouts because they're seeing a shift in their business. People are leaving the gym to do at-home workouts because the most valuable commodity right now is time for people and they can do it for 30 minutes at their home, in their garage, in their living room. And now with people like yourself, they have accountability, they have a group of people they can go and check in with online. You can't get that at the gym. No offense to the gym. I love gyms. Kim and I are joining the gym. There's a new one opening by our neighborhood. I have nothing against them. But this is a piece of the puzzle that you can actually mold into your current business, you know, or mold into your lifestyle. And for 100 pounds, or I, should, I should stop saying 100 pounds. It could be 120. I don't know what it's going to be. For that amount of money to start a business, man, like why, why wouldn't you give it a shot, right? And the crazy part is I didn't even buy a challenge pack to sign up. Um, I spent, I, I signed up for 45 Canadian dollars. I started this business, 45 Canadian dollars. And Kim and I have turned it into this ridiculous thing for us. And that's, and, and when you're talking to other people about the opportunity, like this passion that you kind of hear from me, that's the passion that you're going to have to kind of acquire and talk with because People need to understand what this is, and, and it really is a blessing. And I hope that kind of comes through and makes sense. And again, it's like, here's the other thing. This is the crazy part for me. is like they get to start the business for 100 pounds, and guess what? What other business in the world? You actually get to try the business for 30 days, and if you don't like it, you get to send it back for a full refund. Nowhere. No one told me when I opened my retail store that I could spend $200,000 try the retail store for 30 months and then send my retail store back and I get my turn. It just, it doesn't happen anymore, but you, they get to start this business that way. So it's just, it's a beautiful thing guys. And if you're willing to work hard and sacrifice and mold it into what you're currently doing for you, personal trainers and stuff, man, it can be huge and you're starting on the ground floor and this is going global. This is just the start you guys. So I, I hope me babbling all along made sense to you. Um, I'm really passionate about this and I love training and I love teaching and stuff like that. So um, any Q and A guys, you guys have any questions? You can take yourself off of mute. Look at that. We only lost about eight people during the call. <laughs> I'm just reading through here guys. Yeah, it's late where you are. Any questions guys? We're going to sign off. I know it's late, so I don't want to keep you up. Claire, all right. We'll do a spouse call. You good, guys? No questions? Going once? Going from Guernsey. Thanks, Jamie. You've been great. No problem, guys. Have a good okay. night. And uh, Cheers. Oh, Cheers. I'll continue to post. We're going to do the, tra <laughs> the, the training is going to continue. I'm going to post some resources to go with this call in the group. And then um, we're going to do the same thing on the Zoom, but I'm going to touch on some, other, on some other topics next week too. But the training's going to keep coming, so sorry. All right, that's good. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.